Hello friends, this past weekend we celebrated Thanksgiving here in Canada. It was a great weekend with family and the first time in a long time we've been able to enjoy each other's company in person. Turkey dinners and pumpkin pie didn't hurt either. Last week I was introduced to an amazing new person named Anka Herman who invited me to join her Facebook group. So far it seems like a great group of people who are open to sharing their creative energy and passion in the group. It got me to thinking about the word creativity and how I've been tapping into my creative potential over the last year. Most recently, I've had so much fun using Canva to design new business cards and to design a line of three principles and coaching inspired t-shirts. I ordered three samples which arrived last week. You may have seen my first design, Feeling Connected, in my Thursday Thought video last week. Today I'm wearing this design, Tapping Into Your Potential you can find the whole lineup at my Team UIP Teespring site. The reason I designed business cards, which seems so 2010, is that I was out at a local park a couple weeks ago, reading and enjoying the weather and the scenery, and a gentleman struck up a conversation with me. He was sharing a bunch of stories about his father, who had joined the war effort in World War II at a very young age. His stories were all about how his dad was a con man and had done a bunch of unsavory things during the war, and later in life was a terrible father and a terrible role model. It was interesting because what I picked up from his stories about his father was the impact his father seemed to have on a large number of soldiers, which had actually resulted in them staying on the straight and narrow, being promoted to officers, etc. I mentioned this to the gentleman, that it seemed to me that inadvertently his father had set these soldiers on a path that may have saved their lives, likely had them survive the war, probably to go on to have families of their own, and those families likely to have families of their own. And so like a pebble thrown into a pond, his father had this ripple effect on many people's lives, and it seemed to be mostly a positive effect. So perhaps his father wasn't as bad as he'd been thinking. He appeared to be quite taken by my comments and took a long pause to reflect. I had to pack up and leave to go pick up my kids at school. So I said farewell, and that was that. I'd wish I'd had a business card to share with him. Well, now I have business cards. I fully embraced the illustration my niece did for me, and on the back of my card, I'm now using this superhero version of my Team UIP logo. It has occurred to me that my most prominent superpower is taking action. Many people have commented on my productivity, ability to create content, courses, posts, etc. So I'm embracing it. The top of my list of things I can help people with is to take action. The list on my card reads, take action, make decisions, feel happier, get unstuck, achieve your dreams. All it takes is two words. Coaching, please. If any of this resonates with you, or if you're interested in experiencing coaching, or just curious, I'd love to have a conversation with you. You can find me at coachingplease.com. Thanks for listening. Now go unleash your potential.